to my crazy kitchen. Today we're gonna cook on a budget, okay? Everything is going up like crazy, so here we are. We're gonna cook some healthy, easy, and, um, and good food, okay? And we have to remember, we're not human doers, we're human beings. So don't think of this as, oh my god, I gotta do this, I gotta do this. We have to be while we're cooking because when people taste our food, they go, wow, you know, it's so good, or this reminds me of my childhood. Why do they say that? Because the person cooking it is putting their soul and their heart into the food, you know? So that's what I have to think about when we're cooking, not just I have to do this and go crazy. I'm nourishing my family, I'm nourishing myself, and you know, put on music, put on a lesson, something that makes you happy while you're cooking. And then when people taste the food, it's gonna be amazing. You guys ready? I'm not, I have no idea what I'm gonna do. Um, I have ingredients, I have ideas, uh, I have different cooking um, appliances, so we're gonna see if we can try new things together. I have new tricks that I can try too, so let's do it. a budget episode everything is going to be in shekels in Israel as in uh, what we pay with uh, and I'm converting it to dollars I'm sure all over the world is different prices but this is what it is here this bread is super easy and so good and fluffy um, you could mix it all you have to do is basically mix everything and you can cook it kind of right away and that may be a big loaf I didn't try that yet but maybe thin little loaves so you can cook it right away I do that for my kids in the morning for Chewbacca Chewbada I don't know how you say it but super yum super easy let me know if you try it out If you like these videos that I make about Shabbat prep, you can like the video, subscribe to see what I cook next. Also, um, you can stay to the end of the video because we're going to have the total of how much it was to cook the Shabbat meals. It's about three big meals and leftovers, so I have no idea how much it's going to be, so let's see together. Okay, one second, okay? Yeah, you're going to mix it, okay? What is it? Shoot. 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 What's that so? Garlic sauce. Yeah, garlic. Shoot. Shoot. Spicy? Yeah. Spicy? Yeah. Spicy? Spicy? Yeah. Oh yeah. Very, very spicy. And very healthy. I live in Israel in the mountains. I'm an Orthodox mom of two. And here you can see the beautiful greens after the rains. It's so, so nice. Um, I like to plant some things and the chobeza, this is chobeza, it grows wild like crazy here. Uh, when there was a food shortage in the 40s, 60s, and 50s, whatever, in Israel, people did not have a lot of food, so they cooked with this and made everything with this. Comment if you like wild greens or what greens are in your area that you like to pick or that you want to grow.
subscribers uh, if you can comment your name and where you're from i'd love to get to know you guys maybe your favorite dish maybe i can try it sometime um so let me know and happy to get to know all of you i had a favorite restaurant in california it was called taki it was a japanese restaurant and it has this amazing yummy cucumber salad um, that if you sit at the sushi bar you get it and it's so good so I make it a lot I usually have all the ingredients at home you can leave out the seaweed if you What's this? Lemon one. Oh, oh, lemon. Do it again. More. More. Okay, this chicken is unbelievable. I'm telling you, it is so good. Your kids are gonna love it, you're gonna love it. Friends are gonna love it, your husband's gonna love it, your wife's gonna love it, I mean, whoever. It is totally so good. Um, so what you do first is, doesn't matter if it's frozen or not frozen, you put it in the oven, uh, you, you spread it out, and you put it on high until it's crispy, and then you uh, put the barbecue sauce over it once it's cooked for another five minutes on high, and it is unbelievably yum. Oh, good. 
some fresh air after cooking it actually went super fast which is great so let me know if you try anything uh, let me know if you like it um, also if you have any ideas like if you're from a different culture let me know some recipes you like i had someone on here a cherry canadian uh asked me if i can if i can cook some of the corn or i want to try that so that'll be fun and um you guys have an amazing shabbat shabbat's all about resting and centering yourself again and breathing being with nature, being with people around you, enjoying what you created, not creating anything else. Just finally enjoy, you know, stop working, stop reading, just really be with yourself and be with the people you love. Okay, happy cooking and Shabbat Shalom. Bye. The whole world is waiting to sing this song of Shabbat. The whole wide world is Yes, it's true! The whole world is waiting. Ah! Oh, there go. Bag of onions. Hey, everybody, welcome to my crazy kitchen. Um, <laughs> what are you doing? 